Hi guys, welcome to my channel. It's a girl, Precious Lady K. If you are new, you're welcome. Very tiny subscriber. Welcome, welcome, welcome. In today's video, we're going to be talking about principles that guide harvest or investment. You know, a lot of people have been like, they don't know why they're not getting harvest, why they're not getting increase in their in areas of their life. So I'm going to share with you guys three major principles that guide the, that guides harvest or that guides multiple increase. The very first thing is the principle of sowing. You know, if a man sows a seed, he will definitely yield results. He will definitely yield increase. Imagine a farmer that plants a seed, you know, on the ounces, a crop of the bag where a farmer was on the journey. But well, a farmer lets you go and plant. He planted some on the sand, on the on the paths really. The wind blew it taken away. He planted some among the thorns. The thorns at the top. He planted some on the rock. It looked as if it was going to go. It came out but it died. But he planted some on the good soil. And after a while, it's needed result. So you want to sow seed. You want to explain how best you have to sow seed. And sow seed on fertile lands. Sow seeds in people that will give results. You know, I was any particular man of God that was saying that. So be careful who you sow seed into. You are sowing seed into someone that does not want to sow seed. You are sowing seed into someone. I mean, so sowing seed that I'm talking about here is sowing financial or maybe properties or anything you want to give. It's like giving. So sow seed into that of people that matters. People, not people that matter, about people that matter, people that you, know, you have been instructed to sow seed into. Many people just go on the road you know, that giving. Are giving, you know, it's good to help people to give beggars people the less privileged people give them things it is good but sometimes to sow seeds out people that are already eye up because they're like oh i don't know what to give them yeah you can buy a kit for their children you can buy a kit for them you can buy them a necklace you can buy a vintage something you never have that mindset i don't know what to give my pastor i don't know what to give that rich man i don't know what to give my uncle you know what to give them even if you don't know what to give them you get them a journal they will use it if you get them a pen you can get them a golden pen customize their name on it they will use it up and they will thank you for it so i will say understand the principle of sowing because what you sow you will reap it did not say where you sow it is what you sow and i love one thing i love sowing so you guys love sowing because parents love sowing so please love sowing and i think is that that guides the principle of harvest after you've given it's the principle of saving one thing i propagate very on this platform is that you need to save save money we are not only saving for the rainy day. We are saving for the good days too. We don't only save for the rainy day. We also have places we want to go. We have things you want to buy. There are some bags you want to buy. There are some shoes you want to buy. There are some cars you want to get. So don't wait that, oh, I'm saving for the rainy day. Save for the good days too. Save for your vacation. Save for that place you want to travel to. Save for that course you want to get. Let us say I'm saving for the rainy day. When an emergency happen, when some something happen. No, I'm saving for good days too. Good things can happen to us and we can save and plan for it. So, understand the principle of saving. Start sowing seeds in that regard. Save a particular part of your salary. Because for what you save, that is what you can invest in. That is what you can invest in. And the last principle is the principle of investment. Learn to invest your money. Don't just you know a money save is a money lying in a state of rest. And set to this puts you know an external force that applies to it. And that is now for the place it is when you invest your money in the right platforms, not a Ponzi scheme. When you invest money in the right platform, then it's need result. At the end of the video, I'm going to link a video to a Ponzi scheme, how to organize a Ponzi scheme that I did. So you guys should watch it after this video and learn from it to recognize what not to invest in. So I'll say, you know, invest in right things, invest in good things. It's what you invest in that we need multiple results. Invest in yourself, invest in your career, invest into stocks, invest into real estate. I have shared many things about it. So invest into stocks, invest into real estate. Don't wait to have everything because you have on top of it, 200k to invest. You have over 1000 dollars to invest. Start investing with your ten dollars. Start investing with your one thousand. Invest into your five thousand. Invest into your ten thousand. Save to invest. Don't save to spend. Save to invest. Don't just save for vacation. Save for vacation is good. And I said we're not going to. We're not just saving for emergencies, for bad emergencies. We're saving for good things. Say, like, for example, you want to you want maybe you want a trip abroad and say, oh, just come and pay for. Don't just, just pay. You mean you want, you want to get the you want to get dresses for the trip? And like because you're, because because you're always used to save for emergencies, you're not used to saving for emergencies for good emergencies. You now have money to buy this kind of clothes, you know. So. 
instead for good things, we're not saving for bad emergencies. Yeah, we're saving for good things. So please, let's have the principle of sowing, of giving to the right platform, the right churches, you know, to the good people, people that will yield results, people I help, not yet the less privileged. We are understanding the principle of saving, save your sins so that it can yield most results. And the last thing is invest what you've saved. Save to invest, save to enjoy, save to enjoy life. So you guys, when you have this video, first give it a like, share, and subscribe. See you in the next one. Bye.